This year's presidential elections has caused everyone to talk about race, what it means, with whom you identify. The question is color only skin deep. Well, sometimes color can be a medical mystery. Looking at Texas teenager Desiree Simmons, you might think she was born white. You would be wrong. I know that I am a black girl and that's what I am, even though it appears that I'm something else. A medical mystery doctors still don't fully understand made Desiree's skin color different from that of her brother and her parents. On parent day, when your mom and your dad walk in the classroom, are people surprised that they, they're your parents? Yeah, because there are some adopted kids at my school, so they just assumed I was like one of them. Desiree was born with the same skin tone as the rest of her family. Then, when she was a young child, her mother noticed a small white spot. One little tiny dot on her finger, and I thought she had probably gotten burned. But the spot grew, and others soon followed. It started with the hands, it went to the ankles, then the feet, the knees. And what did doctors tell you about whether or not it would spread over her entire body or if it would stop at a certain point? They actually really didn't know. Desiree's mysterious and increasingly worrisome ailment was diagnosed as vitiligo, a disease that affects more than a million Americans. It strikes people of all races, but it's most noticeable in those with darker complexions. We appreciate hearing your comments about our story, so please email us or record them on your cell phone or webcam and send them to us here at abcnews.com. We'll feature some of you on our daily webcast, and we hope you'll watch 2020 on the air every Friday beginning at 10 o'clock, 9 o'clock Central. I'm Elizabeth Vargas. For all of us at 2020, we're in touch, so you be in touch. Good things just got better. Introducing an all-new third hour of Good Morning America. Welcome to Good Morning America Now. Good Morning America Now. Good Morning America Now. On ABC News Now. Get your Good Morning America Now at abcnewsnow.com.